Hello, hello, Vikings and Shield Maidens. Welcome back to some more Mountain Blade uh, Clash of Kings. Some really weird shit has happened. The Reach has taken the capital city, King's Landing, and fucking executed Joffrey, Tommen, Marseille, and Cersei as well. Like, what the fuck, man? Things are going real crazy here. Uh, I'm, uh, I haven't done much actually since the last video, I've, I've just managed to kill a couple of wildlings and uh, I'm kind of doing some trading and that kind of stuff as well. The weird thing it, is that I seem to be getting one attribute point for each level. That's not how it works in um, Viking Conquest, you only get one every second or third level. And you start at level one here as well. You might do that in Viking Conquest as well, I'm not quite sure, but it definitely feels like I'm getting points into my attributes way quicker than I used to. Uh, maybe like a level 20 is the, like the max level or something, I don't know, uh, who, who knows, man. Uh, but uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty nice actually to already be strength 14, agility 9, 12 intelligence and character 6. Sweet shit. Oh, you guys just gotta love the wildlings, man. So many dudes without shields and such. Uh, I'm getting <laughs> I'm getting my archery skill up by like 10% or 10 points just this match so far almost. Uh, by lucky headshots and such, just shooting into the group at long range. Oh man, feels good, look at that. Like, plus one, plus two, plus three earlier. <laughs> it's just ridiculous, plus two again. And the longbow just deals so much damage. It's, oh, it's beautiful. That's something I really missed, actually, in Viking Conquest. Uh, having a bow that dealt good damage. I guess it might be the wildlings having kind of weakish armor, but... Uh, oh, shit, fuck, man. Oh, yeah, I just forgot. This, it's 70 wildlings versus my 30 men here. Uh-oh. Gotta watch out here. At least I can't die from bloodlust, which is a nice change, I gotta say. It's kind of sweet not having to deal with that crap. There's a lot of these dudes here, though. Let's see, we're gonna have infantry and heroes charge. Come on, men. You can do it. I do actually see very few of my men going down, which is which is very good. Oh, crap, 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 crap. Now I'm the primary target for all these damn arrows. Ah, oh, fuck! Oh, no, please don't tell me we're losing this. Ay, 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 ay. Dos míos. Dos míos. Let me get the camera in a better position for you guys. Oh, no, no, we're not losing this. We're definitely not losing this. I can have 43 men right now. I need to... I think I need to put some points into leadership skills as well, so I can actually recruit a, a lot of men. Because I don't think I'm going to be able to have more men in my army just because I own castles, cities, or, or villages in this game. At least I don't think so. And as you can see, I've been doing some trading as well. We're up to 14,000 right now. Pretty nice. Ooh, got a horse even. The fuck, man? Oh, uh, yeah. And this is something I really like with this mod. Let your companions collect all of the items left. And then you can actually go into camp and uh, access that. You don't have to click each and sing each single individual companion slash hero bodyguard as I call them to actually access it so that's pretty damn nice as well I like it oh that's right men slaughter them wild things <laughs> I don't know why but it's just it's easiest to find oh shit uh, it's easiest to find rebels uh, or, or like outlaws or whatever that you can easily kill and make money without pissing some lord off uh, up here in the north so I'm, I'm pretty much uh, always uh, Trying to come here, oh. trying to farm these suckers. God damn it, man! Son of a bitch! Oh yes! Oh, go taste my oh, fuck! <laughs> I was just about to say taste my steel, but uh, too late. Uh, I've equipped a lot of my heroes, hero bodyguards actually, with the bows and arrows to uh, make it a little bit more easy for them to rank up, since a lot of the time you can get some extra kills out of them, since they don't lose any health by using the bow and arrow first, and then uh, killing the enemy, if you know what I mean. It's pretty shitty bows, though. You need power draw 3 on them to actually... Uh, be able to use long bows. Those are the ones that actually are kind of useful. The rest are like, meh, meh. 
But it, it works. I'm slowly but surely grinding up my men as well. But as you can see, only one guy out of all of uh, my dudes actually survived. Karaver. I don't know if he's like extra skilled or whatever, but they're starting to look pretty good, man. Starting to look pretty, pretty classy. And myself, my horse got crippled. It didn't go back to normal though, like they used to in Viking Conquest. I actually had to sell it and get a new horse for fucking nine grand. So that's why I'm like a little bit low on cash at the moment. It seems some bandits want my coin. They shall have to fight for it. Where the hell are they, you know? Like the the exit is right here, guys. I I could I could walk out of I could walk out of the city any second if you if you want to get oh there they are if you want to get my coin you need to take them. <laughs> oh my god, this is ridiculous. I guess I guess these robbers slash bandits are easy to kill because otherwise they would like rob you too easily in the beginning. But I'm so decked out right now. I don't need to worry about no damn bandits. Mm -hmm. oh, wait, is there one more? Maybe it's the third one. Ah, screw it. I'll kill him off camera. Actually, he's right there. Your friends had <laughs> melee weapons. <laughs> you had a bow and arrow. Did it help you? No, it did not. <laughs> I'm right outside King's Landing and uh, Duke and Dale and all of that kind of stuff. What the hell is going on here? Tells you you find band of traveling moomers. Mummers? What the fuck is a murmur? <laughs> is that like a rumor? <laughs> Recently arrived, you decide to attack the caravan, steal their wares, demand tribute, steal the murmurs' wares and let them live, help them on their way and give them... I guess? Oh, well, shit! I gain honor and renown. Hell, that was good choice. Uh, but yeah, I've, I've been uh, spending a lot of my coin over at King's Landing, uh, Duskendale, uh, and Fair Market, and I dumped about eight grand into, or actually seven grand into buying what is this, twelve, thirteen uh, golden chalices? I'm gonna go all the way to Volantis and check what kind of price I can get for them over here. Ah, we made it to the new land, and some slave leader decided to attack me. He has 14 men, I have 37. His men has clubs and throw rocks. The fuck, man? The fuck you thinking, son? <laughs> so I'm gonna order uh, my archers and that back and, and let my bodyguard heroes, companions, uh, do the fighting, so to say. Let's see here now, tell them to charge, actually. It's to fucking hold fire. They can cut them down quicker than they can actually shoot them down, I think. Hello, guys. Would you mind to give old Andersil a little bit of free XP? And your brain, too. I'm a zombie viking now. Or zombie knight, maybe. I don't, I don't know. Oh, ho holy shit. I, the clubs are actually doing some damage to the horse and me. Fuck. Come on. Come back here. Oh, you're not escaping. Your ass is mine. Oh, actually, <laughs> he could kind of escape. The horse gets so slow after he gets beaten up a bunch. I'm happy I don't. It seems like the player's attack speed and the movement speed and that kind of stuff is not affected by how low the HP is. Dothrakiko. Oh. 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 This might be a little bit more interesting. My horse. Oh, my horse actually got back all its health. Well, that's nice. That's pretty damn nice. Let's see what these Dothraki wants. Uh, let's put infantry in the back. Form up. Gonna have our bodyguard heroes in the front and archers on the side. Oh yeah, they're mounted. This might uh, this might end badly. Who knows? Hopefully it doesn't end too badly. Let's let's put the bodyguards a little bit closer here. Got uh, this mount so we can actually use the longbow. Uh, I got some of my men up to some nice uh, first aid though, so as you can see I got a lot of my health back, dude. These guys are extremely lightly armored. These guys are not gonna be a match for me, I don't know what they were thinking. The Dothraki do seem like they're kind of cocky bastards a lot of the time. Oh man, god damn it, I didn't even see you. Uh, so I'm guessing they kind of took water over their head because right now it's like one dude that's died. Uh, from my team, and I'm just headshotting these guys because my bow skills have improved quite quite a bit now lately. 
And I'm level 16 as well. Beautiful. Here we go. These guys are super light armored, man. They don't even have... Uh, what you call it? Uh, a saddle on their horse. Man. These dudes just got wrecked. Riding skill not... A Okay, yeah, okay. I need to be better at riding to be able to mount those dudes. But is that a club? That's a woman with a club. These women don't look Dothraki, though. Oh, get fucked! <laughs> Gurinir Pike. Good work, mate. Good work. Fucking hell, mate. Oh, he's the only one standing, actually. And he has a longbow. It's only two of my hero bodyguards that actually have longbows. But man, damn, they're big. Fucking huge. I wish I could make myself bigger though. I'm, I'm like... I'm no bigger than like a normal man. <laughs> I don't like that, okay? I, I don't like feeling small. Ooh. Caravan was... Oh, whoa, 100 bucks. Oh, hell no. Riverland, two-handed. Uh, I guess we can take him. I guess we can take him too, sell sword. Nah. Uh, I guess take a couple. Actually take him as well. You never know what kind of people we run into. Those guys stayed out, yep. And, ooh, bent recurve bow, 22 damage. That's just not, not exactly great, I would say, but let's take it. Maybe we can sell it for some monies. Done deal, thank you very much. Let's see now, uh, we're, we're a bit away, so let's head over to... What the hell? Volantis. 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 It's a salsa da italiano. It's a matcha pasta sauce. Oh, uh, maybe a little bit of snail too, yes. Or is it the French that eat the snail? I do not remember. I do know the Italiano is the Super Mario. Uh, he likes the plumbing and I jump on the, jump on the turtle shells. Let's, let's... Let's stop that there. Well, fuck me raw with a goddamn bar pole. Damn, 1700. Okay, that is pretty damn nice. If I can get that in each city, I'm gonna make my money back on these golden chalices really quickly because they're all masterworks or exquisite, uh, which is... Actually, it seems to be giving the same amount of money, which is kind of weird, because the mass... The squi... The squish... The squish should be better. Fuck, man. Words. They're difficult, okay? Oh, man. It just got better. I got 1800 for the first uh, chalice here. Damn. I have pretty much made my money back already. That is freaking awesome. And I got more than half of them left. Man, these fucking Dothraki, they just don't want to give up, man. They can't take a hint. I've slaughtered them in such great numbers. I, I guess they had a slightly bigger army with them this time, but uh, yeah, it's, it's not exactly like it's difficult to get rid of these sons of bitches. <laughs> uh, it's nice free XP though, I gotta say. Oh, we should didn't die. We need to go for them headshots as uh, so we finish them quickly. We're losing some of those like uh, units we uh, rescued, I think, earlier. Uh, so it's not that a big of a deal. We're losing a couple of men here and there, but uh, if if they're all were elite men, like they should have been. Oh, what the hell? There were. Oh, what the fuck, mate? Damn. Okay. Uh, again, I went down. Man, why do I catch so s stupid high amounts of arrows? To the goddamn face and knee. I don't. I don't get it, man. I, at least I got some XP. I managed to pick off a lot of them. Well, damn. Seems like other people haven't been as fortunate fighting these dudes. They had a, uh, I don't know, like a hundred prisoners or something. Holy shit! Dragonstone man at arms. That's a funny looking dude. He has like a dress looking thing on him. These all of these guys do. Holy shit! <laughs> oh my god. That's so cool, man. Cell sword recruits, spearmen, more of those guys. Vol Volatian. It almost sounds like a Voltarian, like one of those painkillers. Elite Kuhoric. That, that looks like that looks pretty badass. I see. We do need to replenish a few troops, though. So I wonder what I should take. Veteran volunteer lancer. I thought it was a Lannister first. But nope. <laughs> oh fuck, it's a camel archer! <laughs> That's fucking awesome! Whoa! That guy looks badass. It looks like the horse has armor even. 
That is really cool. Oh, the game is lagging. Yeah, this guy looks even more badass. Holy shit. 100 bucks a week, though. That's expensive. Very, very expensive. Norvish tribesman. <laughs> One denarii a week. Yeah, this, I think he's probably pretty useless. Uh, I don't know, man. Elite Norvish axe, man. Man at arm. That guy looked good. Let's hire him. What else should we get? Should we try one of those guys? No, no, let's get the veteran one. Let's get an archer as well. Let's get a couple of more archers. Ah, that's good enough, 40. And, oh yeah, three of our heroes are ready to be upgraded. Nice, and actually some of these guys as well. Now I got that 11 of these badasses with their maces and stuff. Oh wait, what the hell did I just do? Crap. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch. Norvos, here we come. Okay, let's see if we run into any more damn Dothraki on the way. Oh, looks okay, looks okay. Let's see what we get for our calluses. Or oh, damn! Holy shit! I should have gone here to sell them. The guy doesn't even have it. Oh my god! Holy shit! God damn! Two and a half, that's ten times the money! That's, that's like ten times the money! Holy crap! Dude, if I sell, sell, sold all, I'm getting too excited. If I sold all of them here, man. Okay, these guys seems to be crossbow kind of guys. Lots of crossbows. Whoa, 55 damage. That is a lot of damage. Accuracy, 59, but yeah, speed rating. I can pretty much shoot twice for every crossbow bolt. So I guess crossbow bolts might be good. When you want your when you want to do maximum amount of damage over the longest amount of time, and a longbow is best for doing the maximum amount of damage in the shortest amount of time. So yeah, DPS if you know what I mean. Oh, crippling bolt. Damn, plus eight damage. Oh, plus fourteen damage. Holy hell! That means that these things. Okay, you might actually do slightly more damage. DPS as well with these. That is pretty ri that is pretty ridiculous actually. Damn. Holy crap. Holy creepity crap crap. Let's get rid of some of this crap as well. But man, we be making monies. We be making goddamn monies. Let's see here. We want to see what kind of stuff our companions got as well. Do 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 do. Here we go. Whoa. We actually got a bunch of horses. That is pretty cool. 45 speed. That is a very quick quick guy. Shipped swords are even quite okay-ish. That's still pretty lame though for I think that was a bad I think around 70 of them I we killed. So it wasn't exactly the greatest amount of money is made, but I mean seems to be close to 1.3 grand. We got 26 grand right now. Ooh, horses. <laughs> All I fucking have is mules and donkeys. <laughs> okay, we're we're not buying a horse here, that's for sure. We're definitely selling more golden calluses here though. Man, I should've I should have checked. We might have been able to get even better cash over here in Kuhor. Almost sounds like Hodor. Uh <laughs> holy shit. Man. I'm I'm starting to really warm up to this this mod man. Except for the map lag. I'm enjoying myself quite a lot. Uh, this is this is pretty badass, to be honest. I think it's time to to head back though and buy some more golden calluses. Uh, <laughs> fuck, man, this is pretty goddamn awesome. Pretty goddamn awesome, I gotta say. Made some good cash today. Economical Viking win, and of course, of course, we're gonna have to deal with more Dothraki. Fourteen of them. These these guys, they they really don't get. A hint, man. I, uh, anyways, I think that is going to be it for this episode. As always, thank you guys so very much for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.